All right, so now we're going to go more advanced on building visualizations in Tableau. We can learn how to create purple charts in Tableau. Purple charts are really amazing in order to compare two data points and find the differences between them. It's like before and after, and it works perfectly if you have categories. So now we would like to compare two years, 2021 and 2022 by the categories. So now let's start first with taking the subcategory, not the category, in order to have more values. And now next we need two measures, the first one for the year 2021 and the second for 2022. In order to do that, we have to go and create a new calculated field. So let's go to the data pane, click over here, create new calculated field. And now I'm going to call the first one sales 2021 and the formula is going to be very easy. So we're going to use the if condition if the order dates, but now we are talking about the year of order dates. So let's move it to year. So if the year of the order dates equals to 2021. So now what can happen if the condition is correct? We're going to show the sales. So then sales and otherwise it's going to be null. So that's it. Let's go and end it. So now in this calculated field, we will get the sales only if the year is 2021. Let's go and copy it because we need it for the next one. So that's it. Then hit OK. And with that, we got in the data pane a new calculated measure for the sales 2021. Let's go and create for the next year. It's going to be the sales of 2022 paste the same calculation but now we're gonna say if the year is 2021 then show the sales so that's it let's hit okay so with that we got our second measure for the sales of 2022 now we want to compare both of those sales in our view so let's take the sales of 2021 to our columns and now in the purple charts we can have like two circles and between them a line in order to find the differences so first let's start with the circles instead of having bars we're gonna go to the marks over here and change it to circle so with that we got in our view the first circle for the year 2021 what is missing now is the second circle so in order to do that we're gonna go and get our sales 2022 move it to the axis in order to generate the measure values and measure names so just drag and drop it over here and now with that we got our second point so the first one the blue one is for 2021 and the second one is 2022 all right so with that we have built the first part of the purple charts where we have the starting point and the end point so now in order to show the differences or the distance between those two values we have to have a line chart between them so that means we need now another type of chart inside our view in order to do that we're going to go and duplicate the measure values so hold control control drag and drop it and just put it beside it so now with that we have the same data on the left and on the right on the right we're gonna have now different visual so instead of circles we're gonna have a line so let's go to the tab over here on the marks to the second one and now we're gonna go and change the visual from circle to line so with that we got our lines but we are not there yet i would like to have a distance between two values in order to do that we're gonna take our measure name from the colors and we're gonna go and put it on the path so drag and drop it on the path and with that we got exactly what we want we have now like a line between two points all right so now the final step is that we're gonna go and merge those two charts in one so in order to do that as we learned we're gonna use the dual axis so let's go to the measure values over here on the right side right click on it and dual axis let's select that so now we got a perfect line to show the distance, the difference between the starting point and the end point. But now we still have small issues in the visuals. I would like to make those circles a little bit bigger. So let's switch to the circles and go to the sides over here and make it a little bit bigger. All right, so that's enough. And now as you can see, the line is on top of the circles, which is not really correct. In order to make it in behind, we have to go and switch the order of those dual axes. So let's take the right and put it on the left all right so with that we got a perfect purple chart in tableau and we can go and analyze the differences between two data points between the sales of 2021 and 2022 and we have this very nice line in order to indicate the distances between them so you can see for example in the envelopes there is no change on the sales between those two years but if you go to the phones over here you can see a huge change on the sales between those two years and in the visuals it really indicates those informations so that's it this is how you create and why we create barber charts in tableau